Welcome back everyone to Change My Life 180. Today is Friday, we're doing a review on Jumbo Grill. Which is supposedly an African food. That's the keyword, supposedly African food. So basically I was trying to get a very interesting restaurant review, Ethiopian food. We called there two weeks in a row, different three dates, three times in total. No one ever picked up. So I cannot do a review on a restaurant that doesn't pick up. So we decided to go with an alternative road for another African restaurant in our uh, area. It's called Jumbo Grill. And we made an order over here for $94.76. And you know what? Um, for $94.76, if I would order anywhere else, I think I would have way more food, but this food this is what you get for $94. It's super light. It barely has any weight. Let's start the review and we're gonna or go with the pricing and everything. I'm prepared this time. I have a check, a receipt, and we can go over it quickly. So let's start with this one. So go ahead, open up, and we'll see what we got. African food, never tried it before. Oh! But I think it's Indian. I also think it's Indian because the owner is Indian, which is nothing wrong with it. I'm everyone just saying. Is the, yeah, exactly. All the waitress when we went there, everyone. So it's nothing wrong with it. Just because it's an African restaurant, I would assume. Anyway, if I wanted Indian food, I would order Indian food. But I think it's a bit misleading. But hopefully, the food will be somewhat authentic and it will be great. Okay, so the first one. Open is... up and see. Okay, um, so the first one is Lamb Lollipop, it's $20. Lollipop, $20? Yeah, so wow. this order is $20, and you have potatoes and um, corn. Four. Four, Four little... What is this, beef? No, this is lamb ribs. Lamb. They're actually expensive, but for still four is kind of... Small, so let's you get two sauces. Yeah, I don't even think we need plates for that one. We can already eat out of there. I mean, I wanna. It's a potato, and let's see the sauce. It's actually smells spicy. I think it's a spicy sauce. This one. It's I hit it me in the nose quite interesting. This the potatoes are good. Okay, let's see. By the way, let's see if it's worth twenty dollars. So that dish alone. It's not hot. It's not even warm. You know, this is purely Indian restaurant, like potatoes. I don't see why it's African food. Is this supposedly spicy? I don't know. This is corn. The potatoes remind me of samosa potatoes that you put inside samosa. Mmm. Mm. This is spicy. It's good. And it's delicious. The corn is very good. It's sweet and spicy. And it's very delicious. <coughs> you wanna you wanna try the lamb? Let's try the lamb. I'm gonna take a bite and you can take the other bite if you want to. Or you can uh, grab a piece of Oh wait. I wanna see this guy. That's spicy. No, it's sweet and a little bit spicy. Where do you have <sighs> Well the sweetness from the corn? Don't you feel it? Mm -mm, there's no sweet. It's very sweet. Mmm, it's very good. You know, potato tastes like Indian food. Corn, I never tr tried, tried something. Tasted like that in the Indian restaurant. Anyway, let's give it a try to the lollipop. Oh. I'm gonna Lime dip in that sauce. I think it's like barbecue sauce. Is it? It's good, it's like barbecue. I'm impressed. It has that smoky it's, flavor. Yeah. I'm gonna try the green sauce over here. Mm. I, I think I prefer with the brown sauce. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit better than the brown sauce. Mm. Yes. It's good. It's good. Yeah. 
Okay, so this dish, the corn is spicy. The green thing is uh, the spicy. herb spicy. The barbecue sweet thing is not too spicy. The potatoes taste. But uh, it this twenty dollar meal will not fill you up. At no, all. it will not fill you up. But I can see the, because of that why it's, it's expensive because of the lamb chops. That's the only <clears throat> reason why I can think why is it so expensive. And again, this tastes like East Indian cuisine, not African cuisine. This is delicious, but again, maybe this is more like, I, I, I don't see the difference. So far, I don't see the difference between African and East Indian cuisine, which is a bit sad. I was hoping a little bit of more variety for the African cuisine. Okay, so, so next. Next dish is, ta -ta 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 -ta. oh, I know what is that. This is French fries. I don't know. This is. is the Choma platter, twenty nine ninety five. And let's open up the sauce. Twenty nine ninety five. So that's what you get for twenty nine ninety five. Ah, oh, it's expensive, and I don't think it's actually legit expensive. I feel like they're a bit exaggerating with the pricing. This looks like kebab. This guy. This. Oh, yeah. And uh, this, this is, is like. Bone. Yeah. This is bone. Beef. That means this is the beef. This is bone. Yes, but it's the beef chop, they call them. They sell them in stores. It's always come with the bone. But yeah, for $30, I think they're a bit crazy with the price. Let's see how it tastes. Yeah, you have your fingers. Is it good? I'm gonna try that sauce. It's good. It's okay. a bit spicy. Do you feel like it's African food? No. Do you feel like it's Indian food? That's exactly what I'm trying to say. It's good. It's actually quite good. The, the spices. spices is very good, but it's thirty dollars. It's quite spicy. It's delicious, but I'm sorry. It tastes like pure Indian food. I don't taste any African. If you Google them, you will see they have the African continent with a big elephant and it has nowhere near. They actually have the African flag, but it doesn't taste like African food. Maybe this so one. So, what is this? Like? It is, uh, I don't know, try it. What is this? This one is sweet. This looks like a bit creamy. Like ranch? Mm -mm. Yogurt. Mm. That might be actually a little bit like African. It doesn't taste like Indian food. Yeah. The sausage is more like kebab. You can see uh, it was on a, like, I don't know, on a stick or whatever, but it looks like kebab. This is like super store, super regular grocery store beef chops with lots of spice, Indian spices. So I'm not a big fan. The french fries also lots of spices, but they're cold. Okay, let me try the french fry. Just french fry. I don't, why is it Africa? Uh, again, sorry. I'm a little bit freaking out because I was supposed to get African food. I'm getting Indian food instead. And I'm actually going to post right here their logo. And you will see why I'm a little bit upset because if you look at it, it's actually African. You feel like it's going to be an African restaurant, but this yeah. is 100% Indian restaurant, which is I adore. I like Indian food. It's like it's one of my favorite foods that I like to eat. But simply, when you want to try African food, you actually want to try African food. Is this the only piece they have here? And yes, you get two tiny pieces of chicken. That's all chicken you get. They're quite generous with their chicken. So let's see, for $30, you know what? The price is outrageous. This is outrageous. This is the biggest plate and I'm supposed to feed five people for $95. Honestly, it tastes good, but it doesn't taste amazing for five, for a hundred, I'm, it's, I just wanna almost, <clears throat> okay. Calm myself. Let's try their chicken. I'm gonna try the houses. And it's not even soft, it's um... It's very dry. Dry. Very dry chicken. 
That's really fun. The lamb chops were good, but the rest of it. Mm. The French fries are interesting because they're like let me Indian. See, let me see the rice. Classical Indian rice. Classical. Oh yeah. Okay, let's see what is that type of meat. I feel like it's beef. This one, it's super dry. Look at this dry beef. Like because the lamb was juice, good. Yeah. This is not juice, but it's so cold. Like we just picked it up. Like it took us between here and there. It took us 20 minutes to get to here. It's very cold. Super dry. You know what? Except for the lamb, everything else is right now. It looks like a fail to me. Oh man, why is it so dry? Hmm. I mean, you have the spiciness, yes. It tastes like Indian beef, I guess. Mm -hmm. Sure. But it's so dry. Even the sauce doesn't help. Mmm, no, 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 no. I will not order there again. Yeah, so this is only two places. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna move on to the next dish. Let's see what we have next. But this is unacceptable. For $30, that's what you get. And they said you can share with two people. That's definitely, I actually specifically asked and they said, yeah, it's a share two people. Um, I feel like it's a share with one person. you have to make To share with two people, I don't know. Even you see, I, I, I mean like, I, with two people like me, maybe you and your friend, you can share it. I doubt it, I yeah. feel like, uh, that no. So next it's... Chicken wings. Those chicken wings cost twelve forty-five, and it's called twelve forty-five. Habiri wings. Yes, twelve forty-five okay, well, for those wings. How many wings do you get for twelve forty-five? Yes. This is plain ranch sauce. Obviously. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Well, basically, it's about a dollar for per wing. That's quite pricey. A dollar? Per wing, yeah. Usually a good price for a wing in a restaurant is about 50 cents per wing. But those ones for a dollar, they should be like <sighs> amazingly delicious to be worth it. So let's see the African chicken wings. African. so dry I mean they're fine but not no all. no <clears throat> also they're very spicy mmm they're not spicy this is not fine this is dry dry wings no they look like cheap 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 dry wing wow this skin looks really cheap like no you know? the lamb the first dish was good but this is a no i cannot believe it what i'm gonna say but i feel like we'll, ha we'll have to cook for ourselves tonight we're definitely not gonna be enough food for five people for 95 dollars and this is so dry jumbo grill you're a disappointment so far a very pricey restaurant. Oh, wow. some really, they're so tiny. Really, what did I pay for samosas? $12.50. This is $12.50. This Wait, whole order, are they supposed to be like another triangle? No, 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 no. no. This they are supposed to be big. This is what I paid for $12.50. $12. <laughs> Six? Oh my god! Okay, let's take. Oh, let's try one. <laughs> you want to open up the inside? Twelve fifty. It's fine. You can swear. We can bleep it out. No swearing allowed. Twelve fucking fifty. Uh, sorry, no swearing. 
Is this what you get inside? This is veggie samosa. Veggie. They're all six. Can I just? I, I, I'm like, I'm, I'm gonna try it. Wait, but why is there a thing here? I think because it's marked as veggie, they had samosa, beef samosa, chicken. And from my overall experience in Indian restaurants, even though it's an African restaurant, I knew it's gonna be an Indian restaurant because samosas do they exist in Africa. <laughs> we went with veggie. But 12.50? 12.50? For six tiny samosas? I'm losing my voice. It's better be golden samosas. They're fine, they're not. It's a good samosa, I guess. It's not the best samosa I tried. Mm -hmm. It's a good samosa. It's. I have better for a dollar. I was about to say, this is like a 50 cent samosa because it's so small. It should be three dollars, not twelve fifty. Ah yeah 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 yeah. Jumbo grill, why so stingy? Twelve fifty. Twelve fifty. Okay, so next we have. <laughs> okay, the last dish that we have after twelve fifty. Yeah, that's the last after twelve fifty samosa. <laughs> oh my goodness! What did I pay ninety-four dollars for? <laughs> what is this? Oh. What is this? I guess this is the last thing that is left. Is pani puri? Seven dollars for beans? Beans <laughs> and chopped onion? Seven dollars for what? Ninety-four, ninety-five. Here, here. No, I'm not no, no. There's hair on it. Oh shit! There is a hair. Do you see hair? <laughs> there is black hair on it. Oh my god! Thank God it was on top, not inside. What is that? I have no idea. What is this? You see, I'm not lying. Ninety-five dollars. Ninety freaking five dollars. That's what you get for ninety-five dollars. That's it. And it doesn't even taste that great. What the hell is that? <laughs> Seven dollars for this. Okay, wait. Let's open these things up. And uh, how do you eat this? I have no idea. Wait, you just have. To I don't know. <laughs> It's seven dollars. They could have added more of these then. I have no idea. I, I'm speechless. Okay, let me open up this weird thing. Ninety-five dollars and I'm hungry just like with it. There's nothing to eat. Everything is dry. With a black hair on top of it. So let's try this. Wait, what is I have no idea. Seven dollars for some beans. Literally, for some bean that costs like Can. less than one cent in mass. Oh my god, this is just raw. Governor. Oh my god, this is really. This is raw. This is raw. Raw beans, raw onion. No, thank you. Potato with no Try flavor. This. That's disgusting. Ah. What the fuck is that? Oh. What is that? <laughs> it's so rough. <laughs> um. We're gonna put some onion. But okay, well, I just can't put that in my mouth. What did I pay money for? I paid seven dollars. Okay, the shit that you throw in the garbage or what you poop with. <laughs> then you pay eight dollars for raw onion, raw bean, and big <laughs> potatoes and freaking things like that. This is what you pay seven dollars for? Are you out of your mind? 
People, if you're eating in this restaurant and you think it's good and it's worth your money, I'm sorry for you, but this is like, seriously, what is that? <laughs> okay, well... <laughs> I'm mad. I don't even want to try it. <laughs> I wanna, actually want to go and give, it, give a refund for this. Like, Lamb chops were good. Oh. Okay, you know what? At first, when I, uh, I think it's a one out of ten. No, it's a, price is like zero. No, I'm like this is that's it. It's going in the garbage. The dog will not eat that. Like I will never feed my dog. I I love my dog. Why would I feed my dog with this dog food that doesn't look like pig food? What the hell is that? I mean, it's actually not bad when you do this. Seven. <laughs> you paid seven dollars for air. You simply seven dollars for this. <laughs> seven dollars. <laughs> for who? Who are you doing this for? <laughs> For watching, it's. Uh, I mean, sorry. What would you rate this nice restaurant? Seriously, it's like. Okay, you have your own judgment. It's like one out of ten. A two. A two. Okay. I'm giving a one just because of the lamb chop. They're delicious, but they're overpriced. Twenty dollars for some dry lamb chop. Oh, okay. Anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Well, I didn't enjoy that review. Ninety-five dollars for this. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> oh my God, this is horrible. I can't. I have to concentrate. And we'll see you next week. Hopefully, maybe next week or the week after. We'll see. Hopefully, with a way better review than that because this is something. I will post the restaurant and like seriously don't go there. This is that, this is a ripoff. That was not. Ninety five dollars for this ripoff. Mm -hmm. This is really open. You can check my other review for the Indian restaurant. You can go there. Way better. This is no. This is not African. This is Indian with horrible twists, with things like that. I don't know. Anyway. I'll see you next Friday. Bye, guys. Bye.